Hello everybody and welcome to Rob Fetz Banty. It's been a while, but we're looking at the X-Wing. This is a part nine, or issue nine. So let's flick through the magazine. So we've got recreating the X-Wing. And we'll be looking at Anakin Skywalker. As the center feature. Our post in this issue will be the XJ6 Airspeeder from Attack of the Clones. And what we'll be doing today is the upper starboard engine. And we'll be attaching it to the wing. Let's get started. So what we're doing first is getting this tiny piece here. And attaching this detail to it. Just like that. Next part of this should be getting the engine mounts. There's a few little holes in the bottom. All we're doing is putting that piece into the hole and attach it together with one tiny screw. So the piece looks like that. Looking good so far. We're getting this piece, the wing, connect it in here. And we can be attaching one screw just in the middle. And this metal piece, let's go in there and attach together with one screw. So at the end of issue nine, we have this, you see the size comparison, that's my hand. So this wing is going to be absolutely massive. Let's move on to stage 10. So here we have issue 10. And Top Merrick is the character we are featuring this issue. From Rogue One I think. There we have a Blue Squadron poster there from Rogue One. It's the upper starboard engine we're working on today. There are the pieces. There are the pieces here. Let's get building. So the first part we've got the engine cast in here. This little piece here will just slot into place and then squeeze it together. I don't know if you can see that. There we've got that bit in place. Next we have this piece here, this piece will just connect into the, the center. Very simple, all we'll do is connect this piece to this piece. Once that stage is complete, this little long bit just goes on that. So end of this issue, we have this piece and these two. Really not much to do in the issue. Let's move on to issue 11. So here we have part 11. Let's look for the pages. Hey, we've got a bit of Django. So we have Django fit here. Picture of Slave 1. More Bounty Hunter goodness. And a fantastic shot there you see of Slave 1. So what we're we doing today. Upper starboard engine. Let's get started. So we're taking this whole chamber. And you see there's some tiny holes there. Let's get some focus. We're just putting this little wee bit inside. So there we have that bit completed. What we're doing now, taking this chamber, putting this into the middle, squeezing down to attach. 
So this piece you're never going to see, but you know it's there. So there we go, just pushed in the middle, just like that. Now we're taking this piece again, all them holes in, and putting all these fiddly bits in. So what I'll do, I'll pause the video and get all these attached. So they have quite a lot of nice detail there. Took me absolutely ages. Better said before, you're not going to see this bit in the middle, unfortunately. Let's move on to issue 12. So here we have issue 12. X-Wing in flight section, Journey of Dagobah. There's an article on Luke Skywalker there. I'm not going to pronounce her name. I think she's from Rebels, is she? Potentially. No poster? No. Oh, there we go. Inside the sublight engine. So that's obviously explaining why we're covering all this detail up. So all we're doing, very similar to the last issue. So I'll quickly build this and then I'll skip to the end. So at the end of the issue, we have this piece here. And we've added this bit on the end, this bit down there, and I assume in future issues we're just going to be attaching that that way. So all the hidden details here you'll miss, but you know obviously that's the internal workings. We have issue 13 here. About Luke Skywalker. This dude here. And the part we're going to be doing today is the upper starboard engine. We've done this a few times now. So what I'll do, I'll build this and I'll jump to the end. And there we have the finished piece. Pretty cool. Issue 14. Visual effects. Bit on Dagobah. Plo Koon there. Two pages on him. And we're upper starboard engine mount. So we've connected everything together. Let's do this. So we need this part from a few issues back. And this piece here. Let's get all these bits together. You guys, we've gone a couple of seconds. This took me bloody hours. I've still got to attach the top bit all around the sides. So you can see the sheer size of this. That's one of the wings, so we've encased the cables here. At the bottom, that's going to be for the lights. Let's move on for issue 15. So here we have issue 15. Recreating the X-Wing. Volt Scaris, I'm not sure who he is. He's a, one of the Empire. And what we're doing, upper starboard engine. Done it before. Skip to the end. And there we have that part. We are looking at 16 now. Sand and mud. Oddball. Upper starboard engine. I think it, pretty much everything gets connected. Let's do this. I'm going to show you this bit because all this effort we put making this part is going to be covered forever with this. So there we are, that part fixed. And the at 17, we're just going to attach the top. So let's do that bit there. So as you see, this thing is becoming monstrous. So all I need to do, all, all my cable management's all connected. I'm just going to clip in the case on the front. And there we have one massive completed wing. So you compare it to my hand, this thing is going to be huge. So the next few issues are going to be quite repetitive because obviously we just could be doing another wing. But what we are doing first, as you see here, we're not, we're not going to go through the magazines, only on new parts. So we've got the glass or the plastic bit that's going to be going. Over here, so let's get this open and have a look. So we don't want to touch these much, so all we're doing is slipping these in and clipping them into place. 
And as you see that looks pretty cool. So here we have that bit connected. Cool. Here we have issue 19. This is the start of one of the cannons. Let's rip this one open. So first off we're getting a big fat tube. Sticking this on the end. Just like that. Small one. Doesn't matter, that piece is complete. Now we have this piece here. Pushing that on. Just like that. Got pegs at the bottom, pegs on the bottom of this. We're just connecting that in. There we have that issue done. We save them for the next. Now we have the parts from issue 20. Let's open this up. So what we're doing now, we've got these two pieces. We're gonna put the LED in the middle and clip these together. Just like this, so we've got a little bit of movement in that. Brilliant. So now we have this little gold piece we've got attached to the end of there. So we just slip that in, pull it close, then pull it together. So we now have that bit connected. Right, it's starting to come together now, so we're just threading this through. Just like that. As you see, we've got a little bit of a gap here for the cable, so we're going to tie that up like that. And he's going to attach this piece. Just like that. Alright, so let's get these two bits here. Push them together. And then feed them into the back. Right, so let's connect this with the lug holes in the bottom. Make sure the cable's through the side. Clip that into place, just like that. So we're going to feed the cable through for the light. And then we'll attach the cover. So that's just come out, brilliant. All right. It'll all be tight when it's all screwed together. Now we'll thread this piece through and stick it on the end. So we have that part in, that part in place, just like that. Put this through the end. All the way up. So we have that in place. Just push this bit in the end. These two pieces we will thread all down and attach. And all we do now is we're going to slide the pole on and clip that in. So that piece in place, all we're doing, we're attaching this to the very end. And there we have that stage complete. Stage 21, rinse and repeat. We have a lot of little pieces here, and have you guys already seen me build a wing, I'll just jump to the end of this bit. So there we have that done. Let's move on to 22. Here are the parts. Right, let's check out the magazine on this, I've not seen one in a while. So you've got your Rogue One issue. got the Grand Inquisitor there, which have a nice poster in the middle as well. There is the tie advanced, pretty sweet. So that's the lower port wing we're building. What I'll do, yeah again we've seen this before so I'll quickly get this one together for you. 
And there we have the wing. So here's a quick overview where we are with the build so far. So you've got one cannon for the other side. We have the cockpit area, so with the glass in. You've got R2-D2. The bottom wing. And this beast. It's quite a bit of weight to that. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. And we'll see you soon on Robert Fed's Bounty.